A class of 25 students shares a class set of 100 markers. On a day with five students absent, which statement is true? So if there's normally 25 students and five students are absent, then 25 minus five would mean that there are 20 students in the class on that day. They're still sharing the same set of 100 markers. So we can take the rate that there will be 100 markers for every 20 students. So that's the rate we're given. Now, if we look at our option cho choices, they're talking about unit rates. We have for every five students, there is one marker. For every four students, there is one marker. For each student, there are four markers. For each student, there are five markers. So we're looking for a unit rate. So since we're looking at markers per student, we have to eliminate choice A and B because the unit is going to be per student, not per one marker. The markers, think about it, one marker isn't sharing five students. Or one marker, five students don't have to share five, a marker because there's more markers than there are students. So if we take the unit rate and we divide the numerator and the denominator by 20, that would mean 100 divided by 20 is 5 over 1. So there would be five markers for every one student, which matches with option D.